Ricky, thanks for coming out to talk to us, of course. A disappointing end to the cup tie. Your overall view of how it all went? Yeah, it's obviously disappointing to get knocked out of the first hurdle, but um, credit to them. I thought they came and um, took the game to us. I thought they played really well. They've got some good players. And, yeah, it's, it's really disappointing. We obviously wanted to try and get a cup run this year, but it's not the case. So we have to try and use it now and um, not let that, that affect us for the league we've got a massive month coming up and um, yeah we've got to try not to allow this disappointing result to um, to feed into that You're not on your own in terms of the results over the weekend it's already was proved on Friday it's been proved on Saturday probably get proved a little bit later over the weekend but it shows that there's no real gap is there? No there isn't I played in that league when I was younger and it's what teams like they, the, it's what the FA Cup's all about obviously you don't want to be on the end of it but um, there isn't a big difference in, in standard in between the conference or national league as it is now and, um, and league two so obviously we're disappointed that we are one of the scalps that has happened but I've been on the end of it before I've done it to other teams obviously my I've had a couple of good cup runs at Newport where we've beaten teams in higher above. We obviously beat Derby last year. So we were the teams that got the scalps. So it happens. Unfortunately, we're on the end of it today. But like I said before, we can't use that. We can't let that dip in form. We, we're disappointed. It was going to hurt us for the next week. and um, But we have to soon pay our attention to Walsall. Yeah, what can it do, you know, a result like that? What can it do for the whole squad? It can spur us on. But, um, yeah, look, we, it's, you're saying the same sort of things. Like, we... We had a good month last month. Obviously, we've started this month off with a disappointing result and um, we have to go again. We can't we can't dwell on it. We, like we say, we don't dwell on the wins and we certainly can't dwell on that result. Like I said, they they, they maybe deserved the win with the way they played and um, we had we had chances. We had a couple of chances first half, we had a couple of chances second half and another day, maybe one of those goes in and, and we take the game to them more and uh, and we go on and win a game. But look, they, I thought it was a little bit maybe soft on the penalty, but... They get given, don't they? they? I think he was on his way down with the view that I had. He, he was on his way down before Phil caught him as well as the ball. So they, they get given. I think if it happened our way, we would have been disappointed if it didn't get given. So Phil nearly got a hand to the penalty, but we reacted. We we had chances after that as well. We took the game and they defended their box very, very well. So look, you have to give teams credit when they deserve it. And, and I wish them luck on the next round. Obviously, it's disappointing that it's not us going through. But we, uh, we've got a massive three games coming up against some big teams in this division. So we have to um, lay it to bed after the next couple of days. Like I said, it's going to hurt for the next couple of days. But as soon as we get back on the training ground, we have to work, uh, work our way looking into Walsall. Yeah, you couldn't have had a, a better three games in terms of you proving what you are, that worthy to be in that promotion race. Yeah, Walsall, definitely. Notts County, Port Vale. Yeah, exactly. It's, what is it, the top three, I think, um, that we've got to go and test ourselves against. And look, it's a massive test. It's a good test that we're going to that we're going to have and we have to see where where we're about what we're about what the squad's about and how uh, how we can get through it and hopefully we'll um we'll work hard this week and um and we're looking forward to going again